This man wants to eat full country. Oblige him. And welcome to another episode of Snacking on the Run. Energy drinks are another favorite of mine to drink on the run, on the road, on the go. But Rockstar is going too heavily on the energy drink for girls thing. I mean, seriously, look at all the stereotypes they got going here. It's pink, it's low calorie, low sugar, and it's a fruity berry flavor. Tastes like berry. They're calling this what? Perfect berry? It's like a raspberry, strawberry type thing. It's sweet but bitter. I can't compare it to any of Rockstar's other flavors. It's the sugar-free girly drink that Rockstar makes. But obviously I've drunk this before. There's no harm in drinking this if you're a man, if you're a dude. I don't know. Like, has this product really succeeded for Rockstar? Maybe they sell it at bars or clubs or something for mixed drinks. But, I mean, as soon as I saw it a couple years back, I was like, what the hell? Like, this is just, this is just too over the top. Especially for something that is called rock star. Like, something really hardcore. I don't know, maybe I'm just being crazy. Maybe I'm just, like, like off my chain. But anyway, I enjoy this drink, pink or not. It's a sweet, bitter taste. And from what I can tell on the ingredients, the same energy kick you get from all the other Rockstar drinks. I just think it's it's just it's just a weird way to play up a lot of quote unquote girl stereotypes. Sugar free because girls don't like eating. Girls want to eat less on diets. It's I don't know like why isn't this a full sugar or a full calorie version? But whatever. Until next time, I'm snacking on the run. Stay in school, don't do drugs, and eat like a freak.